The Barricade Extreme HD rear bumper with LED floodlights is a great option for any 2007 or newer Silverado owner who's looking to stay a little bit more protected at the rear end when they're off-roading or at the job site while retaining all factory bumper accessories and adding some new ones. This one is the most affordable aftermarket bumper replacement option coming in right around the $650 mark. The installation doesn't require too much work, no drilling or cutting is required, so to get it done I'm giving this 1 out of 3 wrenches on our difficulty meter. As you can see, this is a more simplistic rear bumper design that doesn't really go over the top in any sort of way. It's got the protective features and construction you'd want for off-roading, but still keeps it sleek and aggressive for the rear end. The stock bumper for sure cannot stand up to many off-road hazards. At best, you'd walk away with a dent if you come in contact with a rock that was just a little bit too tall, which is still more damage than we want to give our trucks. This is a great way to take a beating without walking away with anything that compromises the appearance of your ride. The design of the bumper also incorporates steps under each of the tail lights to help you get in and out of the bed a little easier, which is great for guys without those extending side steps with a bed step near the rear wheel. This is made from a 3mm thick steel plate, which is a strong and rigid option, but it is completed in a textured black powder coated finish for corrosion resistance and a long lasting good look to add to that durability. The coating was done in two stages using an epoxy pre-coating first, then a high grade textured black to top it off. The cool thing about this bumper that not many aftermarket ones allow is the use of factory backup sensors if your truck came equipped with them from Chevy. They retain your factory hitch as well. When you're shopping around on the site, you'll notice that Barricade offers two different versions of the HD rear bumper. There is a more basic version that does not include the LED floodlights, but if you're doing a lot of off-roading at night or spending time at the work site, you might need some help lighting up the area. This is a good upgrade to go with thanks to the high-powered LEDs. Those are two 3-inch square floodlights equipped with 5-watt Cree LEDs, which are designed with a light rating of 6000K, meaning they are a true pure white. Each light is also rated at IP67, which basically means they're sealed in a reliable waterproof casing, much like an iPhone 7. They can withstand being submerged up to 3.3 feet of static water for up to 30 minutes. This version of the Barricade HD bumper falls right around the $650 mark, putting it at the lower end of the pricing spectrum in the category. There's currently only one bumper that's set at a lower price, which is that more basic version I just mentioned a second ago that comes in $100 less. It definitely comes down to personal preference, but if you find yourself needing the extra light and you want that protection, this is definitely a very good upgrade to go with. This one definitely saves you the hassle of finding lights that fit and getting them separately, then drilling holes into whatever bumper you ended up going with, so this definitely has some ease of use. The installation again won't require you to do anything crazy, but keep in mind the bumper is pretty heavy, or at least heavy enough to make it a little hard to hold up against while installing it yourself. I'd recommend having a helping hand on deck. You want to have a ratchet and simple socket set on deck as well as about an hour or so to get it done from start to finish. Overall, one out of three wrenches on our difficulty meter. The first thing you'll need to do is remove your license plate, unplug all sensors if your bumper came with them from the factory, and remove the trailer plug. Unclip any wiring harness from the clips attached to the back of the bumper. It might help to put jack stands under the bumper to support it while you remove the bolts, but if you've got a helping hand, that might not be necessary. For the guys with the 2007 to 2013 gen, you'll start off by removing two hex bolts attaching the bumper to the top center of the receiver hitch if you've got one, then remove the hex bolts from the side and bottom of the frame. Do the same for the other side and pull the bumper away from the truck. For guys with 2014 and newer gens, you'll start by removing the rear bolts attaching the bed to the frame and loosen the center bolts if equipped. Remove the hex bolts from the side and bottom of the frame, then repeat for the opposite side. Raise the bed up slightly, only enough to clear the bumper brackets, and then you can pull the bumper away from the truck with help. Now for those with the 2014 and newer gen, you have the option to disassemble the bumper to avoid raising the bed up with it installed. You'll release the clips, attaching the plastic cover to the steel bumper, then remove the cover and hardware attaching the outer bumper to the bumper brackets. With help, remove the outer steel bumper from the brackets, then remove the hex bolts attaching the bracket to the frame. Then slide the brackets out of the ends of the frame and install the frame bracket to the passenger side of the end of the frame and then repeat for the other side. I know this sounds extremely confusing with me just rattling off words to you, but there is an instruction manual included in the kit, which will absolutely detail all of this and help you along your way. From here, you can use a helping hand to get the bumper onto the frame and brackets in order to bolt it down. From here, you can then tackle the LED lighting and install them into their open slots on the bumper and follow the directions included to wire them in or customize them however you'd like. You can finish it up by reinstalling all of the sensors and license plate as well as the trailer hitch. 
Well, that just about does it for me. So if you're the owner of a 2007 or newer Silverado, you might want to check out the Barricade Extreme HD rear bumper, which is available right here at americantrucks.com.